What is up everybody today? We've got our Turkish snacks mystery box. Uh, pretty much it is, I paid like $20 and it sent me a 1.7 pound box of Turkish snacks. So we're going to go ahead and get into this. We're going to try a few of them today. We're obviously not going to try all of them because, I mean, it feels like there's probably a good amount of stuff in here. Probably like 15 or 20 pieces. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Comment what you want to see next time. Hit that like button as well if you like this video. So we've got some. Go ahead and show it all in this video and then we'll try a little bit of it. Probably through two or three videos. We got some. Olker Kokomel Pofty Hint I don't know, it's something coconut because I, I see the coconut on the package. So, probably try this today. We're going to throw it to the side. We got some uh, Olker Sutlu Sicolata. I don't know what that is at all. Probably save that one for a different time. Saklikoi Sutlu Cremali. Probably save that one as well. Don't want to try too much sweet stuff, so. Uh, Sick Curly Biscuvi Hay Leaf. Looks like crackers. Uh, Dan Keck Potty Kakalu. These names I'm probably butchering, but I don't know how to say it. Holly, it looks like a uh, chocolate moon pie. We got a Cocomel wrapped, probably chocolate. And we got a, a pink one as well. We have a blue and a pink of the Cocomels. These look like wafers. Deluxe strawberry. There's also a deluxe banana. We'll go ahead and try the banana today with the coconut. And then here we've got a Albini, oh here we go, milk chocolate coated bar with caramel and biscuit. Got a Metro milk chocolate coated bar with caramel and nougat. Metro. Metro going with some more. Coco, coconut. Door. And last in the box is a Coco Star. It looks like they got a lot of coconut stuff, but we'll try that. And we'll try one of these candy bars. Let's try the the one with the biscuit. And we'll try one of the things. So I've got about five things. We're gonna try the. Whatever that word was, I can't remember, and I can't read it on that package. We're going to try the banana deluxe wafers, it looks like. Cocomel pofty, the, the crackers, and the milk chocolate coated bar with caramel and biscuit. So, go ahead and try these out. Hit that subscribe button. Try these biscuits first. Turkish biscuits. So, I'm guessing if you ever go to Turkey... This is what you would probably buy at their like Walmart or snack store. Just like a normal cracker kind of, it says the, what does that say on it? Ooker. Ochre. It says ochre on it. So. Hmm. Imagine a Ritz cracker and eating like a honey roasted peanuts with a Ritz cracker. That's good. That tastes good. That's why it's got like a little bit of sugar on it. Those are really good crackers, man. They're kind of sweet, but they're really good crackers. Next, we'll go ahead and try the biscuit. I guess that's how what they call chips. How was that? I don't know. Looks like a normal, looks kind of like a Twix or a Milky Way.
nothing special about it. Uh, reminds you of a Twix, but more of the like that uh, that like flaky. I guess what they would call a biscuit. I don't know what we call it because I'm not into candy that much, but not that impressive. We'll go ahead and try these. Oh, if I'd have read a little bit more, it does say crispy wafers with banana cream. Ugh, banana cream. Made in Turkey. So yeah, these are straight from Turkey. Oh, they're like little mini, little, <laughs> little wafer minis. There's like 12 in each little thing, I guess. So we're going to try the banana cream deluxe wafers. Mmm. 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 Oh. That is terrible. The wafer was good, but that banana cream is ass. It tastes like... Like, bad bananas. Like, you should be throwing in the trash bananas. We're going to try this next. I want to say it's like a chocolate thing, but it's so light, I don't think it is a chocolate thing. Oh, there's chocolate. Probably hollow or something. Go ahead and just... As you see, it's got a little cookie on the bottom. It's got a little marshmallow topping on the top. I was not expecting that at all. That kind of worried me. I didn't know what I was getting into. <laughs> Ugh. Wasn't that good, though. None of it really had a taste. The last thing we'll be trying today is the Cocomel Puff Tea. All it looks like, it looks like there might, it might be another marshmallow thing with, like, coconut sprinkles, maybe, on a sugar bread or a shortbread cookie something like that looks like a soccer ball on the other side of the cookie kind of cool all right last thing that we'll be trying today of the turkish snacks mystery box there will be a, a part two and a part three trying these Mm. Yo, this is good. That's very good. You can taste that cookie. You can taste the marshmallow little puff thing and those sprinkles. This actually reminds me of those um, icing cookies you get at Walmart. In, like the bakery where you like a little 12 pack, little plastic thing for like three bucks. It's exactly what that reminds me of. Anyway, that's it today for the Turkish Snacks. Subscribe to the channel. Comment what you want to see next time. Hit that like button if you're enjoying the content. And until next time, have a good one.